Hey everybody, Nikki here with Create Make Decorate. For today's DIY, I'm gonna show you how to take this Dollar Tree plastic bucket and turn it into a beautiful galvanized looking tree collar for your Christmas tree. And the supplies that you're gonna need are one of these buckets. I'm using some metallic spray paint, the Rust-Oleum in the silver color, as well as some black acrylic paint. You're going to need something to go ahead and cut the bucket with. I'm just using these sharp scissors here, uh, as well as some type of application tool, a sponge, makeup sponges are both what I'm using. So let's go ahead and get started. So I went ahead and just started by making a hole right into that bucket. You do need something really sharp because it is kind of thick plastic. And then just working my way around, I went ahead and just cut out that bottom piece. Make sure to be really careful when cutting that plastic because those edges do get pretty sharp. So you certainly don't wanna cut yourself doing it. Okay, so here it is finished. How easy was that? Look how beautiful that is. Who would have thought that that was a white plastic little container from the Dollar Tree. Now with a little creativity and imagination, now it's a galvanized tree collar. Now this can be used all throughout the year if you choose to. You can just not cut out the bottom. You can flip it over and you can have it with any of your spring florals, gardening stuff, whatever. Just a beautiful display in your home. You use your imagination with whatever you can think of, but all just for a dollar. I just love it, I get so excited. So let me show you what it looks like with a tree. Now this is not the tree that I intend on using it with. This is just one that I, I had and I grabbed real quickly just so I could show you for sake of the video. So don't judge my tree, it's ugly, so don't judge my tree. So just taking my little tree collar here and then I'm gonna go ahead and pop that right on inside and look at how pretty you guys that turned out to be. Now imagine on a beautifully decorated tree. Uh, if, if your base is too wide, you can go ahead and cut down the side and maybe, you know, just kind of wrap it around there as well. So don't worry if you don't have a tree, if you have a tree that's too big to fit through there, you can always come up with a plan B. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this craft. I know I did. It was so fun and so easy to do. Now, um, please go ahead and sprinkle the video if you loved it. Leave me any comments if you liked the video or some other ideas that maybe you can come up with on how you would use your uh, galvanized bucket. Have a wonderful and blessed day, you guys. Happy creating, and I'll talk to you all soon. Bye!